if you've been a long term viewer of this channel you would know the the nice good old memorable happy go lucky days of us discussing the cope that was if the bleach anime was going to ever return and amongst one of those many discussions about business about marketing about the fandom about what was going on in the world of japan's mindset we did actually come across a discussion that we had i think back in 2019 or even 2020 shortly after the announcement of the anime which was was bleach going to be reanimated re adaptated or was it just going to go straight from the thousand year blood war arc and we have a somewhat seemingly interesting response in regards to that because even though i personally said that we would it actually seems that it was in fact on the table of discussion quite potentially on kubo's fan site in the q a section quite recently there was a very interesting question that i'm glad somebody brought up and the question goes as follows is there any possibility of releasing the bleach anime in a form of a full remake i think with the current technology it will be possible to depict the world more beautifully and so kubo says i have no plans but i would like to or as another translation would say i have no plans but i want to do it at first i didn't really think too much about it i was just kind of like oh cool it just seems like it wasn't going to happen but i i kind of put on that conspiracy kind of hat and was thinking about it more and more it was kind of like when everyone was taking the piss back in i think 2018 when bleach jet art book came out and nakano said to go in to say something such as like you know please continue bleach in the future was a bit of a head scratcher because nobody knew how to support Bleach, let alone the fact that it was going to have a future. And we kind of thought, oh, it was just a play on words. And I, in a sense, kind of see this as a bit of a play on words too. To, to respond to somebody talking about a full adaptation can mean one or two things. And, and hear me out, because I've been through this many times before when it comes to Bleach's marketing team, or when it comes to Kubo, or whatever goes on. So I feel like this is not completely as black and white, and I'll get to it now. Kubo's his team, uh, Shueisha, and whoever the, the marketing team behind it do evaluate this website. They have to kind of pre-approve everything before it gets posted by Kubo. Kubo obviously responds to these comments, but it's not him that posts the comments, so to say. Um, so they have to get approved. Hence why, you know, you'll have some really silly questions that are answered on there. Like, what does Kubo have for breakfast? What's his favorite meal? Like, nobody's asking. Well, I mean, obviously people are asking that. But, you know, I'm pretty sure there's probably 10,000 what does Ichigo's his bankai do that isn't being answered. And it's very apparent that it's not being answered. So obviously there is a lot of filtering going on here. And I noticed a lot of anime questions were filtered the moment that we kind of leaked out the time uh, slot for the anime, which was going to be at midnight. So to come back on this and answer this was very interesting to talk about the Bleach anime because I generally think it's out here for a market research. And what I mean by that is to see how much of a buzz this response gets. Obviously, there is a want for a full remake. It's obviously not going to get one because it's starting off from the Thousand Year Blood War arc as far as we can presume. So what else could this mean? Well, I think it generally goes to how much, you know, Kubo wants to do it. And obviously he does want to do it. He speaks for himself rather than for the production committee, which is very interesting play on words again. He has no plans to, which means that he's involved within the production committee or in the production of the studio to say that he has no plans to do something like that, but he wants to do it. So whether he's been rejected by bringing it up or whether they have other plans for it for uh, for later on in the future that's the question so let's be realistic how could we get a full remake in the the early bleached form well let, let's talk about that we could have something like you know the bleach blu-rays actually being decently done this time yes i am shade in viz media your blu-rays are absolutely shit stop doing them they're bad you cash grabbing motherfuckers <laughs> they're really bad except for like the first six box sets like they're okay the rest of them just, you didn't even bother you didn't even try depending on how well the bleach thousand year blood war does and how successful it becomes it could warrant something like a one piece episode of luffy episode of zoro episode of nami where they would go back and they would do like these hour and a half long specials of like of their arc i believe i haven't seen them for quite a while but they went through pretty much each arc and they made it into a one and a half hour special it wasn't on theaters i don't believe but we could have that with the substitution Shinigami arc 
the Soul Society arc, Hoikamundo Part 1, Hoikamundo Part 2. Fullbring is kind of fine, to be honest with you. They don't really need to touch that, nor do I think they will. Um, so it's quite possible we have that in that regard. Or we could just have compilation movies like Haikyuu and Attack on Titan have. It is very weird because it is assumed that it is going to be the Thousand Year Blue War arc. I doubt that, you know, it made sense for me because I was like, oh, well, they want long term jeopardy from this, so they'll do a Hunter Hunter treatment. However, Hunter Hunter was moved from one studio to another, so it makes sense but as far as we know Perry Art is still working on Bleach so they still kind of have that license so it is very much up in the air I think that you know it will start from Blood War Arc I still think in some format we will have a reanimated Bleach story arc from start to finish but I do think this will really depend on how well the Thousand Year Blood War Arc will do so yeah, this is all up for discussion, guys. I just wanted to bring you guys that piece of information, get your heads rattling around a little bit, and uh, create a conversation from it. So, I'll leave you guys with that. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section down below. I'm going to catch you motherfuckers later. You guys, of course, have this fine day. I've been handsome as always, people. Peace out.